Hey guys, it's James here from Carrot Crew. Coming out with you and coming at you with a new video. Sorry I'm sick today. Um so that would explain for coughing or sneezing or anything. But today this video isn't about skateboarding. Um it's about my science project that me and Tyler Robertson made together. And yeah, basically what it is is it is a low to high powered nerf gun or pellet gun you can make it either one so basically I'm gonna explain to you how this thing works so what we have here is we have some PVC pipe and basically just some modern PVC pipe it's a uh, 12 mil millimeter PVC pipe in diameter so yeah so this is that's what you're gonna need you're gonna need a ball valve right here that's basically the trigger that lets the air in and out um, that? Um, you're gonna need a bicycle pump to pump the air into a two liter coke bottle pepsi bottle whatever so those what you need you're gonna need you're also gonna need if you're gonna make this under this tape under the electrical tape there's plumber's putty which uh, basically it's putty that you put on and then it in an hour it turns to concrete so it's plumber putty under there and then basically to make it airtight uh, we wrapped the whole thing everywhere where air could leak out we wrapped it in we wrapped around it with uh, electrical tape so yeah uh, so I'm gonna show you how you how it works. Well, you, to start, when you have it, is you're gonna make sure the ball valve's closed. So right now it's closed. So I can start. So you pump this. You pump the bicycle pump 20 to 30 times. You load the dart or ball bearing in in the 12 12 millimeter uh, PVC pipe, but and then to fire, you turn the ball valve, and all the air that has been suppressed in here in the two liter bottle from pushing it in with the bicycle pump, it lets pushes the ball pushes the ball out, and yeah, so that's inside the barrel. But for I'm gonna suggest for um, when you're using a ball bearing, if you make this. Um, you're gonna want to put some. You want to put some toilet paper, like just a, like a little clump of toilet paper. Put it in the, put it on the tip, and then put the ball bearing on it, and then just shove it all down with a stick, and then that makes it so that the ball actually has some friction. Cause if you if you just have a ball bearing in here, it, like most of the time they'll be just too small, the ball bearing, so it can just roll back and forth, but. You're gonna want to have at least a, some friction inside the tube so that it has to push really hard to get it out. Airflow will push it out. So, yeah, I would say that um, with a with a dart like a Nerf dart, this would be uh, low low range. I mean, no, like it shoots up to this shoots up to. I think our farthest shot was around 35 feet with a Nerf bullet. And with like with um with our ball bearing, we shot right through a cardboard box. So the Nerf bullet, I would say it's a uh, low low range of damage, and BB gun is mid range. And high range would be like an actual pellet gun or actual gun. So so this is our science project. Dart or dart gun or bullet gun so yeah hope you guys enjoyed this vid i uh, hope it teaches you something how to make a science project if your teacher gives you one of those or something and yeah see you guys later